How's it going? Um, I done a video the other day about the micro freak about the sequencer, and um, I didn't really. I sort of get the gist of it now, but it's not the same as um, recording a sequence on the grandmother like. So let's have a look at the manual. Well, now first, look. Let me show you what I know. Well, what I've learned. Right, so you have it on sequencer mode, boom, shift in the blue, sequencer on. Now there's nothing on this. All right, so let's clear that. So to clear it, you press hold and whatever pattern you want to clear, either A or B. So now there shouldn't be nothing on there. Right, so um, let's do record into step sequence. 32 let's just change it to um 16 so you go utility preset um sequence length I'll put it down to 16 um right so now then uh recall step sequence or just put anything in um yeah let's see if you know i've been uh mucking about with that prodigy tune out of space look bum Fuck that, didn't I? Let's try again. No. Right, um... Right, so it says here on the manual, on page 80, uh, editing a sequence. Once you have entered the desired notes, you can fine tune the sequence either by changing the notes you've stored in a step, in a step, or by adding modulation to a step. And it's got bullet points. Select the sequence you want to edit. Right. So we'll edit A. Make certain that the play is turned off. That's the pattern button. There, the start and stop buttons, the random and pattern buttons. Make certain that the play is turned off and press record. Turn the rate swing encoder to scrub through the sequence. No way, mate. The micro freak will play back all data stored in a step including modulation events you have stored in the modulation tracks. When you reach the end of the sequence, it cycles back to the beginning. If there is a step on which you want to change the stored data, select it with the encoder and hold new notes to replace the ones that were previously stored in the step. To erase the content stored in the step, press the hold icon. This inserts a rest in that step. When the step mode, when in step mode, the active sequencer can also record notes of velocities that you play on an external keyboard into the MIDI import. Right, um... That's mad, mate. Right, um... Wait, hang on, so we're cold. Step one. 